Hello, I'm Mike from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you how to layer up different sounds of noise to make it sound great and create your own sound effects. Okay, here we are in Adobe Audition CC. Go into the effects menu, generate, and I'm gonna start generating some noises. So let's do that with uh, maybe some white noise first of all. Here we go. Standard white noise, then we'll generate a new noise. Effects, generate noise, and we might go for some gray noise. Let's listen to that. Slightly different, and one more time, we'll go into effects, generate noise, and this time we'll go for some pink noise. Let's listen to that. Okay, plenty to play with there. If I take that into the multi-track, let's call this noise effects. And let's drag those all into the multi-track on their own separate tracks so we can start having some fun with them. So you can hear how they all complement each other. Let's start dragging in and making little chops and incisions here. Changes in amplitude, changes in panning as well. So we can start to create something that sounds pretty amazing and impressive. Okay, that's all done. Let's Okay, sounds brilliant already, and I notice I've mixed three different noises. I might pan this slightly over to the left, this over to the right. Perfect. Right, now I'm going to mix that down while I've got that there. Lovely. Bring it back into the multi-track as a mixed down effect, and I can make it shorter by time stretching or longer. And there's all kinds of things you can do. So for instance, I might want to add on some nice reverb. Let's go for a studio reverb. Perfect. That sounds good to me, so I'm going to mix down that. I quite like the sound of that. So multi-track, mix down the time selection. And then I'll go back into effects, time and pitch, and I'll go for the pitch bender, where I can go for something like a turntable losing power. And let's just... Now you can hardly hear that because it's just having an effect on the reverb, but if I was to chop this down a bit, and let's even go even further. So losing power there at the end adds a funky new sound to our sound effect. Uh, there's lots of fun we can have with this. We can even add some tones in and start creating our own radio imaging effects. It's really easy to do this in Adobe Audition CC.